Charlotte is way out of position. Got him scared a little bit. That's a stun. That's another stun. Let's block him inside. I have teammates now. Let's block him in. And that'll be a kill. Easy stuff. What is up beautiful people, it's Celadon here, welcome back to my channel. Today we're playing Emoja Support, a company came by Heimdall and against what looks like a... Suket Ur combo I guess? Maybe Ur Achilles, we'll see. But it's probably Suket, it looks like the man is testing out the Nerf Suket in support lane, which is no longer a thing. So in case you're wondering, so Emoja! Best support in the conquest, hands down, pretty much broken, pretty much double S tier. Uh, should get nerfed and gonna be nerfed pretty soon, but for now, we have the most broken ADC with the most broken support. I feel like it's gonna be a very effective game for us. The circuit puts herself out of position. Oh, she just used her dash. Are you coming back in, girl? You're coming back in. No, that's a mistake. Oh, that damage. First blood. Got her. Ur should be dead here as well. We should chase him down a little bit. Need to body block. Pop my shell here. Gonna slow him down. I see. Caught the stun, which allows Heimdaller to chase him effectively. He's trying to hit some autos and cut the pathing. And that's a double kill. Well, my job here is done. I guess I can just <laughs> go AFK. But you can see how powerful Emoja is. Uh, what she does is that she provides, she has no mana. So she provides insane pressure in the lane and she never actually runs out. So as long as you stay in lane, your mana is replenished. And as you can see, those called armies. And the more mana you build, the more armies you have, up to, I believe, 10 or 11. So certain skills, as you can see, cost 2, 3, and 4 uh, armies. Oh no, we get ganked. Okay, that's an early gank. Can I help the man survive? Okay, literally no, I should, all of my I should really take care of surviving myself, really. We got a stun on the follow-up, super easy to land, like Ymir Walls. I might still be dead here, but I should be safe. Just juking, juking. No, no, the stun they got me. Okay, okay. Let's see the return gang from Molding. Nope, he's too spooked. Well, really, really unfortunate situation here. We got ganked. Uh, I was distracted a little bit describing what Emoji does. So her two is a double spell. You throw in some bubbles that are hard as fuck to hit. Uh, on the distance, but pretty easy to land actually in melee range. Same for the stun. It's a line stun, the center part of it is a stun. And the other part's just dealing a bit of damage. Okay, okay, we got a successful stun. We don't have anything, but body blocks are there. Fortunately, you cannot body block Uller as much. Uh, R2 is a heal. But you can only heal some gods. Our auto attacks also healing and increasing the healing by 10%. So uh, pot's starting to heal like 11 instead of 10 in the oh early game and later on you tend to heal about 5 HP per auto attack. You put like an aura for a couple seconds. So she has like an unlimited sustain for your teammates and pretty much unlimited uh, versatility in terms of spells. My three is a Dude, somewhat is interesting boss. dash. Oh, this man. Oh, okay. So Cat is here. Ulr is gonna survive. We still have our shell. We're gonna bait with the shell. We landed a stun Ulr, which is nice. Time down we landed that last auto attacker would have hit hard. Okay, okay. She's getting baited by shell. That's nice. We need to land this. It did land it. Alrighty then. So as you can see, pretty effective. There's no point at which I'm gonna be having a downtime. And our ult is also pretty crazy. Uh, it's two giant walls and it doesn't consume any armies so we can cast it anytime we have cooldowns. I guess Heimdall 
landed his one and a little damage that I did with my one allowed him to secure the kill, which is nice. Dropping a heal on Heimdall here. Let's see if I can lock down. Oh, that's my ult. Uh, it's gonna be too early, I think. That's a lot of damage. She gotta have a stun. I drop my bubbles again. I'm Dollar is choking his odd attacks and he dies. Unfortunate. I wish we had a jungler too. So this is our three. It's a somewhat stupid skill, but really fun to use. As you can see, if you pop it way too far, it's gonna pop me back and if you're popping it before a certain range it pops you forward which is like if you're chasing someone really far like an enemy and you do that they get popped to a smaller degree but in the opposite direction very tricky if you have like your ultimate you can lock down people inside of it because they try to escape through the chokes and you block those chokes with that three it's also a knock-up CC, which is pretty versatile as soon as you get uh, get used to it. Your middle tower is under attack. Enemies in the right jungle. Okay, hello, Rod Tusker. What you doing? He's trying to poke me out. Oh, I might be dead here. That was a very fortunate stun, but I should be dead. Hello, Haim. Can you help me out? Juke the ultimate here, but I should still be dead. No, Rod Tusker is too afraid to chase. But Sir Cat's still on the chase. Let's see if she blinks in or some shit like that. Let's go. Now it's fine. They caught Rise of Oscar. It's interesting. I'm gonna get the experience off of this wave. Sir Cat also got chased down, and now we can safely back. Hoggers. The bad part of uh, Yumoja's uh, core mechanic is that you don't really get anything out of your CDR because she has no cooldowns besides her ultimate. Let's gank the left lane, just apply some pressure, I'm not expecting to kill him, just maybe pop his ult or something like that. Yep. Didn't manage to block this, he just dashed right through the wall unfortunately. Just dealing some damage, just popping all of my kit, poking him out. Sir Cat's here, it's fine. She's level 5. She's Retreat. not a threat to... Well... Shit. <laughs> Just as I wanted to say that she's not a threat to anyone. Okay, back at her, I was able to... Save him enough with my shell and my healing. I'm gonna grab the experience off of this wave. And probably back away for Serenity. They're getting the totem. Just let's look for some poke. <laughs> yeah. An enemy has been slain. It's not as easy. It's very uneasy, I would say, to land those. Enemy Can we down. kill him? Can you chase him down? Let's go. Already baby. then. After all, my time spent here was not in vain. That's good. That's very good. We should check up that's the thing you constantly ran a, a run out of mana and you want to back like on the back of your mind you're like okay so we're backing now we're oom but then you kind of realize that you never actually oom with this character she, that she runs out very quickly but the omi is replenished also oh that's red tusker that's my ult i'm gonna get down here but maybe do some damage both Janus and Odin died in the mid lane, Bacchusur died in a solo lane. And they traded just Discordia in mid for it, which is totally not worth it. We're still a bit ahead, we didn't lose all of our advantage. But we lost a fair amount. And now we lost all of the advantage. Because Heimdall also stayed in the lane. After the fight in mid, we lost three people. He should have just straight up turned around and run. But he didn't. Can we catch this Ulr though? Is the question. Okay, Odin reached him. He should be dead here. He's jumping my side. Nowhere to go, my friend. It's over. Dude, that guy is literally a bot. Just stack up these minions, allow him to clear. Your left tower has been destroyed. 
Gonna stack these up. Be right back. Looks like Heimdaller is clearing portal, so we might as well do that. Since Ulr is dead, I really want to push this wave into the enemy tower. This way he loses all of that gold and XP. Unfortunately, Heimdaller didn't recognize that. We need to get gold. There's a lot of people in left lane. There's a good chance we'd not succeed, but there's also a great chance that we do, and that'll be completely worth it. I can block it out with my waves. When we get close enough, I will. Maybe not even. I'm just prepared. I'm just positioning myself so the walls would close us inside the gold fury pit. And that'll be the, go uh, the free gold fury. The Scordia is pretty low, but I'm also low myself, so Be careful. I don't think I can chase her down, really. Good jukes. She's gonna jump. There you go. No. Just waiting here for Be that careful. experience, then. She should back with that amount of HP. And we should push, Be because careful. if we do, Be she will careful. lose all of that and golden experience. That's a huge wave. Nice job. Heimdall gets caught again and soloed by a support. Quite unfortunate, really. So we got both Serenity and Hardward, which I understand some people would not be a big fan of, but usually I like to do that because that gives the most protection to the teammates. Also with the Gauntlet of Thieves, but I just find that 10 protections is not too good of an aura, considering how much gold and time you need to... Let's see if we can kill her. Oh, ooh, hello. Let's go, baby. You wanna, you wanna die? Cause I can kill you, you know. She got stunned again. Um, kind of derped here. We have like a double wall. I don't think that's necessary. But whatever. It's always better to overkill than okay, let somebody live where, where he should have died. There's a good chance we can grab this tower. Low Rathatosk is ulting in mid. He's also low, so he's not ulting in, he's ulting out. I don't think we can go for the Phoenix here, but pushing out this wave should be reasonable enough. Hopefully Heimdall is not gonna get solo by Circadi yet again. Rats Tusker's pretty low and still in mid. Can we catch him? Hello! That's his dash. Heimdaller used his ult and hit nothing. Oh, we're in trouble. That's my shell, man. That's all I can. As you see, it's pretty easy to ignore Yumoja if I don't have an ultimate. You just straight up run and that's it. Let's keep Ulr busy here. He didn't join a fight for a couple of seconds. Maybe that will allow Odin to survive. We're coming around here, maybe trying to catch this. Oh, Ratatoskr got stunned. That slows him down a little bit. Odin should not push up like that. Looks like back is her code Discordian in the jungle. We have an upper hand here. We should go in. Blocking Wrath of Tusker as much as I can, but apparently it's not enough. Just let's get out. That's Wrath of Tusker ult. Down on the Odin. You should be fine here. He didn't juke, but I still landed that. Let's spread out. Rathatosko still caught the Odin that was apparently lazy backing. That's very unfortunate. I should have body blocked this ult. Looks like Achilles will land outside of the tower range. Will we able to kill him? Bakasaur should be able to chase him down. Oh, hello rat. I was not expecting you here. Heimdall is dead. And Baka is still chasing. And he's gonna die most probably, unless he jumps out right now, he's dead. Oh, uh, like I said, he just waited for the cooldowns on the enemy team and Sir Cat's taunts.
Blame the support, that's not like classic, most stupid thing to do. Janice is in trouble. It also looked like he was ulting in, not out. Let's just mute the man and not waste our time on it anymore. I mean, typing as much probably distracts you a little bit. As you can probably tell, landing those abilities from afar is quite a challenge. They are very slow and very telegraphed. You have an eternity to, ju to juke that, but the point is... Emoja is kind of your in-the-face support, despite her like uh, very calm appearance. She's pretty much Ymir. She, if you are body blocking people or they're just following you trying to land a couple of hits, stuff like that. Let's mute this, that's annoying. Can he get out? Okay, no, he didn't even try to, huh? Rat Tusker's ulting. Somehow he's going after me for no reason. Probably going after Becca, actually. Oh no, he actually was looking for me for some reason. As if you can kill me, my... Tried to stun Rat Tusker here. Unfortunately, didn't quite land. We're trying to save this Janus, but yeah, it didn't quite work out. Let's body block her inside. She took a, an extra shot for that. But that's the best we can do. And there's a surrender vote in the even game, as expected. Elegant and We're gonna persevere despite that. Oh, all is under Gold Fury. Defend. We need to defend that, but we can't. Keep her here is the best that I can do. Enemy missing left. Achilles is behind me, we should bail. His ultimate is pretty dangerous for any sport, so if I take enough damage. That's like the whole point of circuit support. She builds full tank and still deals insane amount of damage nonetheless. We got Achilles in mid, and that means we can probably fight. Let's see what I can build here. I don't, I'm not even sure. I built a pretty selfish item, the breastplate. Oh, he dashed out of the stun, which means he ain't got a stun. Retreat, middle lane. Let's switch it up. Okay. <laughs> Not as soft as it looks. Stay alert. Clearing on the wave a little bit. Heimdall okay, is getting so lucky in the game. That's like his favorite thing. This game is fine. I body block the stun. I'm gonna get ulted here. Let's ult and we, we have so many walls. It's like a labyrinth in here. Hello, Sir Cat. What you doing? Let's slow her down. Stun her out. She won't be able to follow up. That guy is literally a bot. For full health, we should fight this. It's just a support. Let's heal him up back. Looks like Achilles is teleporting here. We should back off. Slow him down a little bit. Don't think that hit, but he had to juke it, so that's also slowing down. Let's back and grab some items. With them having four physical gods, I decided to go double time on the physical defense with a high Nemean. Feels like a good thing to do. Heim dollar. Oh no. Rats here, which means Heim is dead. It's your job not to die. Come in, guys. I'm all up for it. Let's heal up Baka, that's the best we can do. Just healing him up, giving him the shield. You can see that my auto attacks are healing for 3 and 4, which is pretty significant. Actually, it adds up really quickly. Uh, Rat has nowhere to go, let's keep him inside. Deliver this ult so it not damage anyone else. Achilles is all in, we cannot really kill that. Let's try and peel from the tower. Nah, it's time to back away. They're all fighting support and a solo laner, unfortunately. An ally has been slain. Find contentment. Okay. Ooh, so much damage. That didn't land.
not a whole lot we can do here they just took two towers and uh we don't really have a response to that we're 4k behind looking at the fire giant they sh they should be doing it let's see if we can grab it no it's a bait okay i got baited hard wait was there even anyone <laughs> it, it was damaged it can't be just one person being stupid i'm not sure what the hell that was maybe the game just glitched i don't think that happens oh i'm in trouble let's drop everything we have that's the best we can do and try to get out they should chase me it's not as easy to chase emoji in case you didn't notice i'm still running they're still chasing we should be fine here actually no that's also rad to toss gold they're very deep my team can actually benefit off of it maybe okay okay great great job sir cat's also down achilles should be dead here and discordia is dead no 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 discordia is still alive that was a pretty good fight for us as you can see i have a lot of onis now and my three is a pretty decent dash and i have like four of those if i'm full and when i pop my ultimate i get some uh nasty omni regeneration so i dropped most of my kid and just started backing away really fast and they had to go really Not deep to fun. catch me they did catch me but they traded three people for that that was completely not worth for them and we are a little bit closer in terms of experiencing gold right now which is nice unfortunately our heimdall is level 17 which is less than the enemy support discordia is kind of oh right the oscar sultan something he's ulting back a sir he's probably dead let's pop a shell pop our ults pop everything and try to save the man Ooh, we got some Let's nasty go, damage baby. on the rat to Oscar. Looks okay, like some cat is selling Janus somewhere. We have a Riffic, he's slowed. I'm tanking the tower, but they just don't care. Looks like Ulr is coming this way as well. We should back off. I missed my two. Oh no, Odin, my man. Try to heal him up, that's the best I can do. He might be out. Yeah, we should be out. Can you, like, not kill my man? God damn. Look at the Heimdall AFK in mid lane. That's very nice of him. Let's try and juke as much as we can. Maybe Ulr is coming this way. Let's hide behind the Fire Giant. Okay, he gets some damage off of it. Not enough, though. But, well, he got some poke. Let's see if this Janus steals a fire giant. <laughs> Alright, pretty easy stuff. There was just three people and it had no secure. At least we have that going for us. That will delay our death by a little bit. We had some free gold to spend, so we have a great horrific. Which is a pretty, pretty significant upgrade for the horrific. Looks like Ulr is out of position and Gold Fury is pretty much available. But Janus goes into the mid instead. Let's ward up over here, make sure that they don't see us doing it. We have a lot of objective damage with Bakasur and Heimdall, so it's fine. Is Ulr still around? Because if he, does, if he is, we can catch that. Gonna push this out and go back to the lane. I'm in Discordia chasing. Oh no, that's that's a lot of people. Let's block out some of that. Key is fighting a support. That's a good stun. I heal him up before she popped her all, so it got through. That will allow him to survive it easily. Ooh, nice damage, man. There's two enemies behind us, but nobody pays attention. They're chasing the circuit too hard. And Achilles is coming this way any second. Let's heal up back Asura. Backup can chase us down. I need to heal someone up. All of my teammates are trolls. 
I was able to save just one of them. Body blocks, body blocks, to the best of my ability. Is he gonna get out? He got out, all right. Now I'm actually in trouble, but not like a whole lot. Still a supporter with full HP. Good damage on the circuit. Rod can blink away, I think. He should blink, right? Do you have a blink, my man? An enemy has been slain. No. Okay, whatever. Just die, I guess. Achilles got caught into the owning ult. I can heal up. Odin should push up with us. Wait, come back. I want to help you. Hold still, please. Let's block this Phoenix out that will not allow them to successfully defend. An enemy Looks like Odin played. took the full brunt of the Discordia <laughs> and died, yeah. but at the same time we killed over here, so we definitely should take this Phoenix. That's a lot of minions, I can just do it myself. Titan is pretty much available, but Serket is coming up in 10 seconds. Can we finish this? I don't think we can, and nobody's really focusing the Titan as much. I'm committing. Nah, fuck it, I'm not committing. It's too scary. <laughs> Help! Yep, Haim is dead, we should just leave him. Janice should have no trouble getting out. Did I, did I land the stun? I did not land the stun. Oh, come on, girl, you jump into us like that. I wish back I had more penetration. Hello, Reddit Oscar. I will not survive this. I am not surviving this. Damn. We're taking a fire gun here. Uh, looks like it's worded. I'm gonna ward up over here in the choke. Make sure that nobody tries to seal. Ullet is way out of position. Got him scared a little bit. That's a stun. That's another stun. Let's block him inside. I have teammates now. Let's block him in. And that'll be a kill. Easy stuff. Well, it's not like I soloed him, but still, I got the kill. Which is the only thing that matters. Right? Right? We need to attack the Titan. No. Oh, look at the Heimdall dealing the massive damage to the Titan. We should really go for the Titan now. But it has like 10% HP. Just commit to it. Drop everything we got and it should be good. There you go. They did not expect Heimdall to deal as massive damage to the Titan. That's probably the only time he was useful this game, to be honest. So in terms of builds, we have Sovereignty, Traveler's Shoes, Heart Ward, Breastplate for a pretty selfish build on the Mian because they have four physical gods and Shoguns to just amplify the attack speed on Baka and Heimdall and well actually Nodin as well, he's a jungler so he's pretty swinging. In terms of kills participation we have 16 out of 37, uh, not the worst but definitely not the best. Uh, in terms of damage, doesn't really matter, but in terms of warding, as you can see, I have 13 wards, which is the biggest on the field. And our Janus, the loud Janus, has actually won, which is quite unfortunate. Yeah, but in terms of damage, uh, our mid is actually way behind by a third of the damage. Me is actually on par with the enemy support, but that doesn't really matter. Our ADC is almost twice the damage on the enemy, or maybe he wasn't as bad as I thought. He was just dying like a lot, a lot. He is the highest death on the field by far. <laughs> The solo laner obviously out damaged by the aiming solo laner this Achilles was having a blast was really fucking annoying our jungler is also destroyed by the enemy jungler so I really have no fucking idea how we won this game but we did it and it's awesome hooray for that in terms of warding you can see that both mids did really really 
poor job, especially considering that they have those free words. They just fail to place them no matter what. And yeah, guys, that'll be the game of Emoja, the best support in Conquest right now, period. She just does way too many things, have way too many things, never have like a downtime. She can always heal you up with her orders. She can throw insane amount of shit right at once because she has no cooldowns. She can lock people down. She can secure objectives. She can dash your whole team into engagement with two portals. She can heal. She can put on shields. She can destroy shields. She's just ridiculous. She's annoying as fuck. It's really frustrating to play against her. But instead, they nerf things like Merlin and stuff and keep this thing broken for like the whole split with no problem whatsoever. And yes, it'll be the video uh, Yemoja Conquest, guys. Hopefully, you enjoy the content if you want to ask me a question leave a comment and respond to all the comments on my channel if you like the video leave a like on the video if you are new to the channel please subscribe it helps me immensely and as always i hope to see you in the next video have a wonderful day